Gentlemen, ladies, welcome back to Call of Cthulhu, Dark Corners of the Earth, where we are in this deep one city, deep underwater, causing rampaging horror and destruction to these guys. Hmm, usually it's the other way around. Oh well. You know, it's funny, this game. Um, I've probably made it clear, this uh, second half of the game has been a bit um, lackluster. I've, I've... Not as good as the first half. And the funny thing is, there are still, like, spots of really cool stuff in this game, but... I feel like every time I've, I've gone in phases and sometimes I'm like, oh, I have to I have to record the next episode. Oh, God, but it's such a shitty part of the game. And then that's actually turns out to be a really fun episode, like really cool stuff happens. For example, uh, that time that time we escaped from the Order of Dagon's house and got on the ship. I thought that was really fun. So then I'm pumped for the next episode. Like, yeah, we left on a really good part and we're going to have a really good time in the next episode. And, you know, for example, again, then there was all that stuff we did on the ship involving the engine and stuff, which is actually terrible. I, I really hated that part of the game. You know, we had to do the ship's engine fixing and the stuff on Devil's Reef and stuff. And then again, I was like, oh, I'm gonna, no, I'm gonna have to record another episode. And then we've had, I've had a really good time here in the Deep One City, actually. So again, I was positively surprised when I was dreading the worst. So this game keeps flip-flopping on, like... I'm expecting to have a good time, and then it's a really awful ride, and then I'm expecting it's going to be a slog, and it turns out to be a really fun episode. So this time, I was once again after the... This has been a really fun episode, so I was looking forward to coming to recording this one again. You know, we got this crazy vine climbing we're about to do. And <laughs> this time, when I lo loaded up the save, there was a audio bug where a... Uh, what, nothing to say about the bunk bed, Jack? Okay. An audio bug where the waterfall effect was just super loud, drowning out all the noise in the game. And I was just like, really? Really, game? We're gonna do this? Come on, don't do this to me, game. And I dicked around for a while trying to transition areas, and eventually the sound turned off so we could have a proper episode. But I was like, hmm, 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 gonna have a fun time in the Deep One City and horrible gameplay glitches right off the bat. God damn it! But let's not let that stimmy our good mood. Let's keep on going and, uh... Yows, this looks... This is just like those rooms... This is just like those rooms in the beginning of the game that the Great Race of Yith built. Or, well, at least the cultists of the Great Race of Yith built. So, uh... I've seen a room similar to this somewhere before. Ex yeah, well, kind of, kind of... This place doesn't seem to have been used for thousands of years. What are you, an archaeologist all of a sudden? Where do you work that out? Actually, his incredible gunplay and wittiness would be explained by him being an archaeologist, to be perfectly honest. Um, hmm. Eh. Eh. No. No. I want to get... Oh. This looks familiar. I've seen machinery like this somewhere before. Oh, and you put crystals in these. Ah, okay. See, I, I called it at the end of last episode. This place we go up here, would our progress would be blocked unless uh, we had the uh, crystal. So we should go chisel, chisel, go chisel that out next. No problemo. We'll just head on down to that cave. Now, otherwise, this game... Hasn't been nearly as buggy as I feared. Well, I don't, don't know. I've had the odd weird crash at moments. Um, and also, we've apparently we've already passed the blue light bug that I mentioned earlier. Looking up some talk about it online, I was like, well, like when do I, I had to know, like, like, when does it happen? What is it supposed to happen? Like, so I can brace myself for it? The blue light bug referred to, in an early part in the ship, the Urania, um, when they ask you to use the cannon to look at the island. Now, normally, in the normal game, there would be blue lights, apparently, flashing on the island, which represents sorcerers casting spells at the ship. Yeah, that sounds ridiculous now that I say it out loud. And apparently it's, like, super impossible to hit those sorcerers with the cannon. That's what you're supposed to do, but it's, like, it's like completely pixel-perfect, incredibly difficult and stuff. So the patch I downloaded simply um, simply makes that part like skips over it that uh, the sorcerers don't appear. You don't have to shoot them. You just have to wait out a couple of waves that come crashing, and then um, then the game moves on. 
so that's really good. I probably I can't imagine myself becoming incredibly frustrated trying to hit the sorcerers in that part, or trying to figure out what to do. Cause boy, was that an unclear moment. What was going on in that part of the game? I completely missed it while I was. I'm not gonna bother saving because I'm just gonna be running back to the back to the uh, through the lab anyway. Just get the, this. Yeah. Come on. Work it. Work it, Jack. Work it. That should do the trick. Ah, yeah. Perfect. Well, let's go see if I can't power the machinery in the, uh... In the Yithian chamber with this crystal then. Uh, ow. I'm going the wrong way again, aren't I? Also, how did I hurt myself? No, we're fine, ultimately, but, uh... How did I manage to hurt myself in that little jump there? Jack is so clumsy, apparently. Also, I should, I should keep this gun ready. I don't know. Speaking of which, I think, I think that's the signal. Yeah, I was gonna say, I don't know how often these deep ones spawn out of the deep one holes. Shit, it's not loaded! I forgot to load it! Oh, double kill! Perfect! Oof, and then I waste an extra bullet on the third one. Mm, embarrassing. Any more of them? No? Alright, we're good. Yeah, I'm... <laughs> For once I was like a step ahead of the game, I was like, I wonder... Let's switch the revolver for now and the low on rifle ammo. I was like wondering... How often, uh, how often the deep ones spawn from those deep one holes, and they spawn right away. I bet it was triggered by me picking up the item. So we can assume this is using uh, doom logic, like picking up items will trigger the monsters to come out of their holes. Seems to be a safe assumption. Yeah. So I'll save there. Now. Uh, actually, I should be careful. I remember there being some deep one holes here in the prison area as well. So just gonna play it cool. Is that a? I see you. In fact, I should probably have the. Now that. Yeah. Ha! I was thinking I should use the rifle here because he's far away, but. Eh. Why bother? I. There's another one. Oh. That wasn't great shooting at all. That's a bit embarrassing shooting, for being honest. Oh, another one? Damn. One shot, one kill. Blown away, that dude. Oh, I'm sorry, I stole your ammo? Oh, cry me a river. Oh, I'm sorry. Fish guys don't have tear ducts. Oh! Didn't I get cocky a bit too early, huh? Did he clip me? No, he didn't. He didn't have a chance to clip me. Okie dokie. So back to the Yithian chamber. So mm, that raises all sorts of interesting questions. Like who actually built this cavern complex and stuff? Was it Dagon cultists or was the, how much of this stuff was already here when the Dagon guys showed up? Okay. Now what happens? Voila! It's too hot to touch. It's being used as a power source for the machine. Okay, now it heated up. Oh, right, there's a button over here. Let's go. Power up. Oh, oh my. Uh, 
Well, there's no giant carrot-shaped monsters coming through this time. What? What is this now? Looks like some sort of turret. I... Where is it? Where's the item I just picked up? Oh, is it a weapon? Because, like, my weapons aren't displayed there. Okay. So it's some sort of wrist-mounted... double dabble Wow. Fancy. Ooh. I can't, uh... I can't, uh... Can't, um, there's no iron sights to aim down, but, uh, looks like. Oh! Oop. Interesting. No, it doesn't rapid fire, but it does seem to charge up, uh. Holy cow! Oops, okay. Jesus! Holy cow! This... Oh! Ooh, 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 ooh. Apparently I need to be careful around water with this thing. Well, what a... What a... What a weird thing to throw at me, game. But, uh, okay. Now I have this thingy. Sure. Why not? Oh! In fact, I think I see a fish guy right there. Actually, I'm not gonna go right there. That's the uh, that's the one door I said that would loop back uh, in the um, in the dormitory area of the fish guy caves. Interesting. This is. Let me just check over here. Uh, it's too dangerous. I need to find another way out. I don't mind this ammo here, though. Thank you. Interesting. Yeah, I probably. I'll take this way. I mean, with video game logic, we'd be jumping into water, which would be fine, but. Uh, maybe this would be one of the rare games where. Uh, whole video game logic doesn't work out and. Falling on water actually hurts like, like, like hell. Don't, don't try to save yourself by jumping into water from a high place in real life, guys. You're gonna really hurt yourself. Ooh. Oh. Okay, so he got he got got. Okay, well now what do I do? Um because uh I Freaking okay. Where do I see this thing's ammo? D does this thing use ammo? It's like... None of these are magic electric gun rail cannon ammo, so... <laughs> the only thing I have left is... The only thing I have left is the... Uh, tunnel with the starfish, right? I mean, there were a lot of ways to go in the last time I left off but um at least I felt like there were tons of stuff to, and, and routes and stuff but uh I think I think that's all I have left now is the, the, the tunnel in the waterfall cave shit I don't know this is a this is very perplexing I was expecting I wasn't expecting a teleporter and, like, a freaking rail gun. That's a kind of... That's a bit weird. I suppose I shouldn't be uh, calling this game out for being weird, since that's kind of the name of the game with uh, low craft. Oh, I need to stop doing that jumping around. I'll, I'll end up hurting myself. I keep forgetting.
So I don't really have anything else except this thing, so... Jeez. Need something to clear a path. Okay. This isn't doing anything to them. Oh fuck! Actually, now that I think about it, that might do the trick. I uh. <laughs> oh, I, oh, it's only a couple of scratches from being electrocuted alive. All right, it's fine, guys. It's fine. You know, electricity is no problem. Jeez, Louise. Did that clear the way? <laughs> okay. Kind of looks like it. <laughs> You've been protrocuted. You've been protrocuted. You've been protrocuted right now. That's basically what happened there. Let's keep this big boy ready. This kind of makes... Mm, this kind of makes the other weapons a bit redundant since it seems to... Blast guys... Well, first of all, I mean... Fish guys just die from one shot. It doesn't seem to... I don't see an ammo counter on it. Oh boy, it's gonna be embarrassing if this has only a limited amount of shots per game and you get game over if you use it all. Oh! That sounded like that thing was gonna collapse. Oy. Oy, oy, oy. But anyway, assuming this thing's just like this weapon that you can use to... Come on. We're not going back that way, then. Weapon you can use to... Um, indefinitely um oh gosh loading thing it really kind of um, makes all the other guns obsolete except maybe the rifle since the rifle you can aim down the iron sights you can aim pretty far with that that's like the only one maybe it, it like still might find use for, for close range this thing is just gonna be the best weapon i guess i, I don't know. Oh, this looks ominous. Weird crack in the disc. What was that? One of those seals the Yithians moved into? Oh, oh crap, crap, crap! Yeah, it probably is because uh, now that I remember, definitely they talked about five five-toed footprints, and whoever left these footprints. Has some freaking huge legs, let me tell you. It's down here. Dead end. Okay. Um. Oh, is this? This is. I, I remember that cutscene, weird cutscene we got with with Jack remembering the Yithian times. Yeah. They mentioned something about an energy weapon. Uh, are we holding that right now? Is that the point? We were supposed to find this energy weapon so we can. Uh, I don't know. Save the Yithians? Ow. That hurt like a mother. What is... Oh, because I was bleeding out or something? That was a weird noise. Or am I standing on a poisonous crab? Or is this flower poisonous? What? Ah, never mind. Not that way. Look at the size of this cavern. And this creepy wind is blowing all the time. Kind of bad. Oh, so sorry, sorry for that little skip there. I was uh, preoccupied for a second. That looks like there's no way back up from there, so I'm gonna risk this way. Well, actually, let's keep moving, shall we? Ground's a bit unstable here, if you ask me. Like, really unstable. Oh, my God. Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. A tornado. Can't even... What the? Holy... Am I seeing this? Oh, this must be... I can't rem see, that's what I can't remember. Oh my god! Oh! 
That's what I can't remember about them. So like, oh yeah. I can't remember that about um, Shadow Out of Time. What were the enemies at the Yithian spot? Come on, load up! I guess the answer is this thing. Ugh. Where'd he go? Did he teleport? Oh, God, or is he dead? Shit! Ow! Oh, no! There he is. Ugh. Did I hit him? I think I clipped him. Because he... Oh my god! Oh. You down yet? No! Oh, he's trying to suck me in! I think. I can't tell for sure. Oh, that missed. Yeah, take that. Okay, I think he's dead. We, we cool, brah? Ah, he, he's not dead. You, you are one ugly mother. Oh, I thought he was making his death animation. Oh, peekaboo! I see you. That felt like he was dead already. I think. Let me just suture myself up. Take this chance. Owie, owie. Oh, oh, shit! This is like the legitimately scariest monster in the game because I've got no clue what this thing is. Sucking me in! Suck on this freak! Take it! Take it like a man! Yeah. You you just fly on away out of here. Let me just do that real quick while he's while he's reeling. I think he is too humanizing of a pronoun for this bucko though. Where'd he go? I can't. See, I can't tell this guy's. He is teleporting. He has to be. Did that. Uh, did that uh, take care of things? Oh, man. I mean. Again, ignoring the whole, hmm, whether we're being truthful to Lovecraft or not by freaking beating these monsters with an energy weapon or not. That was like the most intense part of the game since the chase with the villagers. I am impressed. That was kind of, wah, oi, huh, what? Oh, oh, you can climb this, oh, okay. Good thing I stumbled on this by accident. I was been like, how do I get out of here? Oh my god. Oh, well. Well, they gave us, I don't know, rifle ammo, I guess. But I'm pretty sure if those were the monsters that uh, the Yithians were afraid of, we were supposed to use this gun to fight them anyway. Not, not regular human weapons. They would not be effective against such a beast. Well, this is a ventilation shaft. Again, of course, that's what the one ventilation shaft that lit the Robert March's room was called. Oh, yowzers. No, not that way. This way. Oh, more health? Perfect. Oh, we just need one more suture and now I think I'm topped up. Man, remember at the start of the game when I was doing so well and I was always had all the first aid I needed, like I had more than enough, and then, then shit got real and I started getting hurt, like a whole lot. I've been paying the price ever since. Oh, woof! That was a close one. Like, oh my god, another one, okay. What are they expecting me to get hurt by on the way here? 
Oh, a save point, thank goodness. I was gonna say, I sure hope we get a save point out, because... That was a bit scary of a fight, you guys. I don't think I'd want to have another go at that. I guess now that I think about it, that fish guy prisoner in the... Oh my god. In the uh, laboratory also mentioned that there was an ancient evil down there. So, yeah, we killed a monster way scarier than any of this Dagon and Hydra and their deep mouth, deep one ilk. Deep mouth. I'm Innsmouth. Innsmouth deep ones. That's a deep one hole. I wonder how well this thing works on, like, actual deep ones. Oh my... So... You know, call me crazy, but I feel like we are getting close to the end of the game. This looks, this looks very, this looks awfully like end of the game-ish. Which means we're gonna have, as I mentioned, the other big bug in this game is you apparently might be too slow in the PC version to do the final escape run. So I'm a bit scared. I really hope this is gonna be a cancelled Let's Play in a second. Oh, this looks... It's a shrine for worship. Oh, okay. I hope I can pull off the final run. We're gonna see... I I, I have a feeling we're gonna see it... near the temple. We're gonna see it pretty soon, but... Uh... Shit, for all I know, there's... I'm only at the halfway point of the game. The game's gonna be like, No, no, Jack, you've solved the problem in Innsmouth. Now you need to get to Dunwich. I heard there's even crazier stuff going on there. And then we have an entirely different game in Dunwich. Dunwich, 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 uh, and, we're, you know, and the second half of the game is going to be like, well, you knife fought the deep one. Why don't you try knife fighting Nyar Lothotep now? How about that? Oh, fuck. Fuck. <laughs> no, can I check this thing first? This, this isn't a doorway, this is a gong. <laughs> this gong must be used as a call to worship. Oh shit, I probably shouldn't have done that then. I... Ow! My ears are ringing. Weird. Oh, fuck! They heard me. Oh! I see you boys are having a ceremony here. Did I, uh... Intrude upon it? Okay, and the rifle's probably better here. God, as I mentioned, iron sights, baby. Well, this is the shotgun. Fine. Oh god, I'm going a bit crazy here. Ow! Oh. I appear to be out of ammo. No wonder I'm looking. It's super fine, guys. Hmm. Oh. Come on, it, all the scary stuff is over, Jack. Stop being all nuts. Except for whatever this is. 